So now we will turn towards our next control which is the last control for the syllables which is the text area. Previously we said the text fill which is a single line and text area is a multiple line where you will have a multiple line for example for address and for filling your information suppose they are abstract some this type of uh, information for that purpose we use text area. Now let's turn what exactly are the constructor how exactly we are going to build this text area. In Java. Now the first one is a text area where nothing is passed, which here is empty, empty where the constructor contains no parameter, so it will create only an empty text area. Now the next one is a text area, integer number of lines and number of character. Here you have to pass the number that you want a particular height and particular width. Now number of lines. Now here number of lines means here it will be your height. And this one it will be your birth. That means number of character and number of lines. So here also it is very important that first one it is a number of lines and then the second parameter is a number of character. So just this also remember. The third one is a text area string. Here you have to pass the string. By default whatever you wanted suppose to be there already in the text area. So here you can pass it in a double quotes. Now the next one is a text area string number of lines and number of characters. This is a combination of both where you can pass the string also number of lines that is the height and the width. Now the next one is a string then the integer number of lines and number of characters and here is a bar. So here it, it will have some quality constant. Now yes bar means what? As it is going to have a multiple lines so it will be not expanded. So here we will have a scroll bar. So for that purpose whether you want a scroll bar for both or only horizontal or only a vertical or if you don't want so here you have to specify the integer as bar now here how exactly here i have given an example scroll bar then there is an underscore both just remember this all are in a capital letter and here is an underscore so here will be scroll, scroll bar underscore both or scroll ball scroll bar none or scroll bar underscore vertical underscore only or a horizon means depends upon the requirement of the user so now next we will see the methods regarding the text area so my dear friends now here we will see the methods regarding the text area as i told text field and text area these classes are yes they are classes of the aw2 then too they are the subclasses of text component class that means text component is a super class for text field and text area so as it is the uh, subclasses of that so it supports the get text then the set text is editable it's not editable this all the method that we see in text field are also supported for a text area that means you can use for then again here are some of the method that is append insert and replace the range from the name only you can understand now just see what exactly the parameters are there for this now the first one is append here you have to pass the string just see the parameter is string now suppose here is a string in the text area and you wanted to append somewhat another string so here you can pass the string that so that at the end of that particular string it will append the string that you have passed here now the next one is a insert string integer index now here you have to specify the index so at that particular index whatever the string is passed it will just will get inserted okay just understand the uh, difference between these three of the methods and also understand its parameters okay now the next one is a replace range now here you have to pass the string that you wanted to replace from where to till when means from which index to end index means from the start index you have to specify an index that whatever the string you wanted to replace here you have to pass a start index and end index and there the string will be replaced so this was the method of text area if you have any kind of question you can mention in the comment section and thank you so much for watching this video thank you